Hi everyone, welcome to Wedra Studio. Today, we are going to talk about boron. So now let's get straight to it. Boron is the fifth element, belonging to group 13 in period 2 of the periodic table. It is a metalloid, a substance with both metallic and non-metallic properties. Boron has an atomic number of 5, with 5 protons and 5 electrons in the atomic structure. It is a very hard element, second only to diamond on the Mohs scale. Boron is a solid at room temperature. It has the highest melting point and boiling point of all the metalloids, at 2,075 degrees Celsius and 4,000 degrees Celsius respectively. The name boron comes from the Arabic word burak and the Persian word bura, which means white and the mineral it was extracted from. Borax. Did you know that borax has been used since ancient times for thousands of years? In the 8th century, it was exported from Tibetan lake beds along the Silk Road for use by Arabic goldsmiths and silversmiths. However, the element itself was not extracted until 1808. The impure amorphous boron was isolated by French chemists Louis Joseph Gay Lussac and Louis Jacques Bennard, and English chemist Sir Humphrey Davy simultaneously. In 1909, the first nearly pure boron was produced by American chemist Ezekiel Weintraub. Today, boron is obtained by heating borax in the presence of carbon. Pure boron is a fairly rare element on Earth. Unlike many elements, which form in fusion reactions within stars, boron formed after the Big Bang by cosmic ray collisions. Some scientists believe that the trace amounts of boron found in ancient sedimentary rock formations could have come from outer space. Boron is not found in its pure form in nature. Instead, it exists as compounds, such as borax, boric acid, and borates. They are found in sedimentary rocks, oceans, and in certain types of soils. They can also be extracted from various minerals, including ulexite and kernite. The demand was one so high that people moved to live in the extreme heat of Death Valley, USA, where boron is found. Boron has many uses. As boron burns with a green flame, it is a common component in pyrotechnics and fireworks. Boron is an important alloying element of high-strength steel. Originally used in European sports cars, it is now used in nearly every automotive manufacturer for certain strengthening bars, gussets and pillars. Boron is used in neodymium magnets. They are the most powerful magnets invented in 1982 by General Motors and Sumitomo Special Metals. They are used in computers, cell phones, medical equipment, and etc. Did you know that boron is an important nutrient for plants? It helps to maintain the integrity of plant cell walls. Typical effects of boron deficiency include stunted and misshapen growth. Boron is an excellent neutron absorber. It is used in controls rods and nuclear reactors to keep nuclear reactions in balance. Other important compounds of boron are boric acid, borax, and boron oxide. Boric acid is commonly used as mild antiseptic and major ingredient in eye drops. It is effective against cockroaches, ants and fleas. Borax is a common ingredient in household laundry and cleaning products. It is also found in cosmetics such as lotions, sunscreen, and in paint and ceramic glaze. A mixture of borax solution and glue creates oobleck, a strange non-Newtonian liquid that is liquid when it is poured, but solid when it is under pressure. Boron oxide is used in glass and ceramic industries in the form of borosilicate glass, Pyrex. They are heat resistant and have a low coefficient of thermal expansion. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.